Fortnite. Fortnite, as we all know, is one of the biggest games out right now and has been massive ever since season one came out. Everyone knows someone who plays Fortnite, and you may even play it yourself. I know I do, but I don't play it that often. We all know Fortnite completely dominated the gaming world. It has changed gaming forever, but it also changed something else and has dominated something else ever since its release and that's a YouTube. What's up guys? So today, as I just said, we are going to be talking about Fortnite and how it completely dominated and still completely dominates YouTube. Fortnite changed the Battle Royale games forever. We all know PUBG and other BR games that were out before Fortnite, but Fortnite was totally different. Fortnite gave off a new color scheme with very colorful saturation that no BR game had ever done. The game has so many bright and fun customizations for skins and emotes that just appeal to so many people. The ability to be able to build around yourself and save yourself and hide. This especially because it was like an addition of Minecraft into a BR game. The game had a more fantasy-like style of graphics, and this was so much different than PUBG and H1Z1 that it just appealed to more people. Fortnite was also a free-to-play battle royale game. PUBG nowadays on Steam is $30 to purchase. Fortnite is completely free and you can play whenever you want at any time and download it at any time. It also had a different overlook of the inventory system and brand new types of weapons and heals and other abilities, along with so many more different things that you could do in this game. Since YouTubers are always trying to think of new and different content to make, they saw Fortnite when it came out and they were like, oh yeah, fuck yeah dude. So they just had to jump on it. Fortnite as we all know also changed the lives of so many YouTubers that were basically nothing before this game came out. These were YouTubers such as FaZe Jarvis, Rest in Peace, Tifu, Ninja, and Laserbeam. I know Laserbeam was still big before Fortnite came out, but this just blew him up even more. My dad just came into my room and told me that he gave me a pizza from Little Caesars that it was deep dish pepperoni poggers. But Fortnite got them millions of views, millions of viewers, millions of subscribers, and millions of dollars in such a short amount of time that it just completely changed these YouTubers lives forever and it's changing even more as I'm telling you this right now. Fortnite is also always in YouTube's recommended section and is basically the only game that is in the gaming section for trending. But sometimes, and I'm not even exaggerating, there is also one or sometimes multiple Fortnite videos in the regular section of trending. This shows that YouTube's algorithm is pushing for Fortnite content and new Fortnite channels or even Fortnite channels that are already big to be recommended and shown to a bigger audience. And finally, Fortnite has opened the door of possibility to anyone who wants to do gaming on YouTube. Since there are so many kids and people who watch Fortnite, you grow rather quickly and your content could be stumbled upon very easily and like I just said this would help you grow very easily. The game in general is helping gamers grow their channel or if they're a streamer on YouTube grow their streams so that they can reach the goals that they want to achieve. Ain't that swell. But the game is still broken as f and it will never be fixed. But yeah guys, thank you guys for watching today's video and I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, it would mean a lot if you could leave a like on today's video and please don't dislike, don't dislike. Please just comment down below what you didn't like about today's video and I will try to fix that for you in the next video. Also guys, please be sure to subscribe and turn on those notifications so you know every time we upload another video because we got a lot of great content coming your way. But yeah guys, thank you for watching again and yeah, uh, I'm gonna go eat some pizza.